So Tono is taking us to this new part of the Enchanted Forest so that I can test my magical powers and prove that I'm a worthy magician. Did you guys see that portal orb? That was like the coolest portal I've ever seen. That's some, that's some great portal hacking. What kind of watch do you have? Is it a Mach 2? A Mach 80? Is it a Mach 8000? I didn't even know those were on the market yet. Does your friend have portal travel brain or she just have the mind of a hairy muskrat? <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, no, she's smart. She's really smart. She's a, a hacker. Yeah, and hacking is pretty much like magic without the dorky magic stuff. Magic is not dorky. Uh, no, yours isn't, but it's a little dorky when it comes from a weird forest elder with a stick. Am I to assume I'm the weird forest elder with a stick? You, you'd assume correctly. Okay, okay, let's just play nice. Guys, like this video if you want to see me test my powers and succeed. What are you doing? I'm liking this video. Thanks, Brandy. You guys are quite ready. We can begin the test? Yes. There will be three parts. The first is a test of endurance. Ooh, yeah. Okay, that's not Ava's strong suit. So we, we can just, just move on. Leave. Yeah, she definitely didn't pass gym class. I mean, have you seen her throw a punch? <laughs> She's right. It's not a test of physical endurance, it's a test of magical endurance. Okay. I think I have that. You must hit all three targets with one continual stream of electric magic without hurting the tree. 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 Without hurting the... Tree. Without yeah. hurting the okay. You must be powerful and yet gentle at the same time to protect the creatures in the world around you from which you get your true magic. Okay, so one final question. I can't hurt the tree? No, no hurting anything other than rifters and mute. It seems like your obviously confused friend and I finally have something in common. What did you just- I said you only have three chances to get this right or it's back to the enchanted forest for me to wait out another million years waiting for a worthy magician to come along. Okay, guys, comment down below the four-leaf clover emoji because we're gonna need some serious luck to get through this. Okay, um, how about this? Just picture me as the tree, okay? What? So, you know how back in the hideout you hit that target before you hit me, um, we believe in you. Okay, okay. Here I go. Ooh, okay. Two out of three. That was um not unsuccessful. Good. Unsuccessful. But it's okay. Just try to picture me as the tree harder. Okay, hey, it's fine. No. It's okay. No. Just, I actually have an idea. It might be terrible. Uh, we'll see. What? No. <laughs> yeah. You didn't charm me with lightning back at the hideout, so maybe that means you need a little encouragement. No, 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 no. Okay. Brandy, that is not how this works. This is way more dangerous, and I'm honestly not gonna be able to do it. Hey. I believe in you, okay? And I also believe this could hurt me really, really bad if you don't do this right. So you have to believe in you. You could do this. Okay. <sighs> Whoa, oh my God. You did it. You did it! I seriously thought you were gonna hit me with lightning. Me too. What? Um. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. All right, Yoda, what's interesting? Oh, was I saying that aloud? Never mind, on to the next test. Uh, he was just here, right? Yeah, he was right next to me. What the? Where did he go? Do you think he's strangely like the most annoying person you've ever met? I'm not a person, but I admire your attempt to insult me with your 
Incoherent babbling. <sighs> Great, he's back. Oh wait, that was actually so cool. Was that an invisibility potion or an invisibility powder? <gasps> was it an invisible cloak? Like in Harry Potter? See, I knew that stuff was real. Yes. Wait, you like Harry Potter? I thought you thought magic was dorky. Uh, it is, but not the magic in Harry Potter. I mean, he has a pet owl. An owl! I've always wanted a pet owl. Guys, comment down below what magical creature you've always wanted. I think someone's a little more into magic than they like to admit. The Potter myths were what? taken from our history, but I'm not wearing a cloak. Real wizards don't wear cloaks. I use pure magic. Okay, so like levitation invisibility. Exactly. That's so cool. I turn myself into particles so that I can fly through time and space. Holy smokes, what? Invisible flying? I've always wanted to fly, like an owl. Like, you remember when I said yeah. that I like owls? That's what You're I just said. And them. also, I want to be able to fight, though, like while I'm an owl, but also fly. Can I do that? Can you make me do that? This is not some childish trick. Real magic has real reward and very real consequences. Okay, I'll take the consequences. It's fine. I mean, what good is magic if you don't fly? Invisibly. And that's something I should be doing right I now. I refuse to indulge this irritating hack saw. Uh, I'm a hacker. Hacker. Okay, guys, don't you want to see me fly? Comment down below fly if you think I should go invisible and fly. Who are these guys you keep referring to? Are there fairies or dragon spirits or willow lilies? Yeah. They're our friends. Uh, and they're actually people, I think. What strange sorcery. Hmm. Okay, well, if you want to make your ogre-helmeted friend fly instead of yourself, I guess you can. But as you know, it takes the same amount of skilled precision to not make her disappear into the nothingness. Um, what's the nothingness? It's nothing. Then why does it sound like something super duper freaking scary? It's not scary, it's just the place where all magicians go eventually. Basically, they lose their physical form and then they re-enter into the universe as part of the magical world. Huh. That doesn't sound so bad, I guess. Exactly, so you won't mind if you turn into nothingness forever. Forever? Like, what do you, what do you mean, forever? Let's get started. All right, let's do this. Brandy, you don't have to do this. It's not too late for me to just make myself disappear. No, I volunteered. I regret it now, but it's okay, I'm not worried. Well, if you think this is nerve wracking, make sure you stick around to the end for Ava's final challenge. What? Okay, don't worry about that. Let's just focus on the task at hand. Okay. Okay, remember, I love you, I trust you, and... I did it! I made her, what? Well, it looks like you turned her into nothingness. Can't say we'll miss her. Where is she? Oh no, she's lost. Wait! That was awesome! <laughs> You're alive, yes! You didn't disappear into nothingness forever. Why would you think I'd be in the nothingness forever? Nothing. Very well done, but there's still one more test. Okay, don't worry about that. I mean, after making me disappear, what could be so hard, right? You'd be surprised, it's magic. Is that the light vortex? I thought the vortex was a bad thing. No, 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 that's the dark vortex. But the light vortex, that's the source of all good magic. That's where all the beautiful magic in the world comes from. Precisely. The light vortex is a magical universe that lives above ours. There are tiny portals everywhere that some humans can find. Perhaps a fairy in a flower or a lightning bug that follows you home at night. Or maybe the magical yellow glint of the sunrise. But the vortex will only open like this for a truly worthy magician. So if you are worthy, step up and see if the vortex will open. Uh, Brandy, can I talk to you over there really quick? Uh, mm -hmm. let's go, let's go. Hi, so yeah, I've never seen the light vortex ever in my life. I've been looking for forever and it's never opened for me ever. Yeah, but you're different now and you can do anything except for a fight. 
And also you're not really great at hacking, unless you're hacking into a bag of chips, but even that's kind of hard for you. You also can't really- Okay, Brandy, we get it. Right, okay, I'm sorry. We're doing this together, okay? And I know that your magic seems a little imperfect right now, but it's your magic, and that's what makes it truly magical. <clears throat> I don't need another second. Uh, how? How is this open? Did we open this? <gasps> what? We both are worthy. Both? But I don't do the whole magic thing. No, but the legends of old and future tense always speak of two that are needed. One for magic and one for protection, both equal allies. So I'm the protection? It didn't say, like, hacker or butt kicker? I'll have to read the leaves on that one and check. Okay, get back to me. The point is, it'll take both of you to protect magic and both of you to defeat Mute. Oh, I can defeat her. That may be the case, but you can't banish her to the dark vortex and close the rift forever. Okay, so any ideas on how to start? Uh, what? This is the Wand of Songs. The only thing that can send Mute back to the Dark Vortex and close the rift. Um, this is an ukulele. It's yeah. It's much more than that. So, any idea of how we can find it? This will show you the way. What? Um, uh, this is just an arrow. Yeah, and it already disappeared. It will show you the way and your path will be revealed. Do you have any other advice, like, helpful advice? Don't fall into any of Mute's traps. And most importantly, don't let this map fall into the hands of the Rifters. That's it? Noted. And this. Call upon me if you are in need. And I mean extreme need. Okay. Thanks. Thank you. Well, thank goodness he's gone. He was annoying, right? No, we need to concentrate. Oh, right. Okay, uh, what did the map say? Okay, I think he was pointing this way. Uh, or was it behind us? Or was it more of a metaphorical arrow? Like, choose your own path? No, we should go this way. Oh! Um, uh, why can't we move? We are in a trap. Oh, right. We are in a rifter's trap! We took one step, are you serious? <laughs> They're really good. Do we have crystal service in here? Give me that thing. Throw it. Wow, great cat. Thanks. Wait, no, 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 don't use it. I should have handed it to you because he said only in dire emergencies. Okay, well, do we have cell service? Because if I had my gadgets, we could definitely get out of here. Guys, make sure you're subscribed because you don't want to miss Brandy's new gadgets and us figuring our way out of this trap. And remember to always stay, whoa!